Let's talk about sex, baby. Let's talk about HPV. It's estimated that there are over 100 different strains of HPV. In most cases, human papillomavirus or HPV will go away on its own. However, if it does not, it can cause serious health issues such as genital warts and certain types of cancer. Only some of them can cause cancer. There is currently no way to know which types of people will develop health problems such as warts or cancer. Symptoms of HPV may not be obvious at first, which can make it hard to know if you're infected or if your patient is infected. In our clinical practice, it's important that we know who is susceptible to getting HPV, how it's contracted, and the signs and symptoms that we can look for and ask our patients about. Anyone who is sexually active can get HPV. It's commonly transferred through anal sex, oral sex, or vaginal sex. Mothers can also transfer it to their children. Most research also indicates that HPV can be spread by oral contact through contaminated utensils and medical devices. The immune system usually destroys HPV particles before they can cause an infection. And even then, a healthy immune system can clear the infection within one to two years. When HPV does produce an infection, we need to look for a growth that can be a number of things and often confused with other types of oral lesions. An HPV growth can be flat or raised. It can be smooth or rough. It may be red, white, pink, or flesh colored. It can be cauliflower-like. It's usually painless and slow growing. In upcoming segments, we'll talk about how you can recognize the early signs of oral pharyngeal cancer in your patients, and most importantly, how to speak to them about it. It's important that we get comfortable talking about sex, asking our patients about sex, because hey, we're healthcare professionals on the forefront of fighting a very serious and life-threatening disease. We can no longer sit back and let anyone else handle this for us. We have to loosen up a little bit, talk about sex, because if we don't, who will? Let's talk about sex, baby. Let's talk about STDs. Let's talk about all the things that you might see in the oral cavity. Let's talk about sex. Let's talk about sex. Woo! Come on. Bursties? All the bursties. Louder now. Help me out. Come on. All the bursties. Let's talk about sex. All right. Bursties? All the bursties. Louder now. Help me out. Come on. All the bursties. Let's talk about sex. All right. If you have any questions about any of the information, I'd love to hear back from you. Also, I'd love to have some feedback on future segments that you'd like for me to talk about. Thanks for tuning in. See you next time. HPV, the most common STD. It's likely that you and me have HPV. Say what, Missy? Just wait, you'll see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, Lord, help me.